in 2001, I think, or 2000, we started a, a theater production of Jesus Christ Superstar. Um, Kimo played Jesus. Stretch. <laughs> uh, and the, the, after that, after we get done with that, we decided to form a band uh, with some of the girls that were in the show and um, the, the band that was played in the show. And uh, we were called The Regulars to begin with, and we had several lineup changes over the first couple of years. And then Milani came in about 2002, 2003, somewhere around there. And we ended up changing the name of the band to Next of Kin. And that's the genesis of how it started. Our CD, we took quite some time to make it, um, hence the title track, quite some time. Um, but it was it was a really fun. Uh, we got a good number of originals worked out, kind of molded into our what we are now. Uh, our first CD really is nothing like the CD that we release now. Um, it took us a little bit to just find our groove and everything, and uh, the CD came out really well. The CD has more of a uh, theme to it. it. The songs sound the same because, like she said, we found our way. The first CD was all over the place. Yeah. And oh, this one, sound. even though we had different writers on the songs, you know, all within the band, the CDs, the CD sounds together. Part of that was probably because we found a keyboard player. Yeah. Name Mr. Dash Dixon. Right here. <laughs> That's not my name. Okay, I'm sorry. Mr. John. John Dash, Dash Dixon. Dixon. There you go. So sorry. <laughs> I just got fined. Make a record of that. <laughs> <laughs> In case anybody got to write me a check. <laughs> Well, we all share in the writing. Um, I've written the majority of them, but it's a phenomenal song. Right? Yeah, Mr. Oh. Songwriter here. Yeah, well, once you go to the bathroom and write another song, it takes about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's what I do. <laughs> we like it. <laughs> um, I write. I write quite a bit. Um, I usually have to write ten songs to find one that we like. So there's for every good song on the CD, there's ten bad ones someplace. <laughs> Terry likes to write some seductive songs. My songs are about sex. <laughs> he likes the sex thing. Pretty much. <laughs> Either lack of or grateful for. Yeah. It's either love gone good or love gone bad. Either way. <laughs> relationships. A lot of our songs are about relationships. It's the easiest thing to write about. I feel like a stranger. A stranger in my own bed. What we're trying to do now, really, is just trying to get into uh, better music venues, festivals. I think we want to continue to focus on making our own music. Um, that has grown a lot over the past few years. Our skill level in that, I think, has, has increased. And the more we do it, the better we get. And if we can get away from a lot of the traditional cover songs and just find our own stuff, that's one of the things we want to strive for. In your head. Well, our live shows are really, um, it's really all about the vibe, uh, feeding off the crowd, um, energy that everybody puts out. We basically get up there and have fun with each other and we just love what we do, and I think that reflects on the crowd. We always have, that's one of the comments people a lot of times make is, I just love the vibe of the band. We try to keep our, um, our live shows very free and kind of open. Mm -hmm. We don't have a certain set list that we're going to follow. We just kind of wing it as we go. Uh, we improv a lot in the songs. You know, there will be a long breakdown in this song one night, and the next night we won't even do that song, or there will be no breakdown. and. We just kind of play off each other. We feed off each other and the audience. It's just, you know, we are about having a good time. You know, we want people to come down and enjoy themselves, enjoy us, uh, enjoy the music. We try to keep it fresh, you know, and uh, we have a lot of really great fans. We, we kind of nicknamed our fans the Knockers. 
<laughs> Melani's idea. And some of them have some. Pretty, some, <laughs> some of them have knockers. some very nice knockers. Yes. <laughs> yes. But they're hence, all knockers. Hence back to the sex. Part. <laughs> <laughs> it really does. That kind of gives that interaction with our, our fans. Really, I love being called that. Actually, they. Yeah. They're like yes. They're, they're part, of, <laughs> part of the family. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Which is the whole thing that we kind of go for in this band is family. You know, and, um, that's why the name came about next to Kid, because we feel like we're a family. Some of us actually are a family. Mm-hmm. Me, me and Dash. He's, he's my father. <laughs> um, <laughs> but and we 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 like to incorporate that aspect of it with our fans, and even with people we don't know. You know, str- we love meeting new people every night when we play. You know, mm-hmm. people who haven't heard us before. We like to try to, you know, sometimes we'll get a reaction from from someone we don't know. Oh my god, I've never seen you guys. You guys are so great. And that just makes us feel really good. You know, we like, if we can earn one fan a night, it's, it's, it's a good night. 